Hey, what's going on everyone? Today's March 26, 2023. We're going to talk about NVIDIA today and see if this stock is still going to go up because I've been following the market and NVIDIA since like the beginning of the year. We've been riding the market higher on all of our price predictions. It's been fantastic because here it is again, another price prediction that we've created in NVIDIA right here on March the 17th, right? We did an update video on March the 17th. This price prediction goes all the way back since February though. Okay, so we did a video in NVIDIA on February the 14th, 2023, looking for NVIDIA to go up. We did an update video. Go back and look at all of our videos in NVIDIA. You'll see it on the 17th of March. Still looking for NVIDIA to go up, right? We were still bullish in the market in NVIDIA. And here it is, you guys can see it. The last couple of days, the 23rd, the 24th of March, market hit our 18% target. So we're done with that. The question now is, are we looking for price in NVIDIA to go higher still? Is it still a buy? Because we are emphatically understanding that at some point, price will fall, okay? Some point. This is the current trend. This is how the market in NVIDIA has been trading thus far. Are we still bullish? Yes. Why? Because price is still trading above this ascending line. Now, this is a very steep slope. Like the market here in NVIDIA is massively bullish. And so many people who act like they're technical analysts who do fundamental analysis did not even expect the market in NVIDIA to move as high as it did for the first half of this year. Like, check this out. Since the 6th of January. So the first quarter of 2023. The market in NVIDIA has already seen, see that, <laughs> 97 and a quarter percent. And they want you to hold these stocks for 40 years. When in less than a three months, you could have garnered 100 percent of your money. You could have doubled your investment in NVIDIA in less than three months. But they want you to hold your positions for 30 years. Are you serious? This is a phenomenal move. You have to give the market credit when credit is due. And this has been great. It's been fantastic. This is what you're looking forward to when you're coming into the stock market. You're looking for a market to be biased and move a certain direction. So if I'm a buyer in NVIDIA, I'm looking for something like this, right? And we've been tracking NVIDIA the whole year. All of my videos are still fully public. And you'll see on all of our videos, we've been playing the strength into the market and NVIDIA doing just this. Are we running across? Are we running out of gas? Are we about to embark on a barrier that is going to begin to push NVIDIA down? The answer is yes, it will come. And you need to be prepared for it. Because as we continue to see this, this great move in NVIDIA, it's going to be a lot of people who think they missed out and the ones who feel itchy just to get in a position to capitalize off of this already three months move. They're going to get in late. Now, let's look at the chart, though, because this is where the market will actually tell us where we could possibly begin to see the selling. OK, that first area is going to be around 280. 280. So we're going to start out looking at NVIDIA on the wiki chart. OK, and I can already tell by the amount of volume that came in last week and how the price bar closed that there is still some sellers in the market. We're beginning to see selling now. OK, we've seen it about the same amount of volume on the prior week and the market spread is a lot wider than the last one. What's going on? Well, we're seeing sellers. Sellers is currently coming into the market in NVIDIA right around here. Okay. This is where sellers are at. Just saying. Be prepared. Let's look at NVIDIA on the two weeks. How do you think this two week price bar looks? looks bullish or looks bearish what do you think it still looks bullish right it still looks pretty good 
that buyers are still interested in moving the market higher in NVIDIA. What about on the three weeks? Same thing on the three weekly price bar. The market is still bullish. Like this is fantastic. Hopefully you all was able to capitalize off of this move because a lot of other stocks are not even trading like this. Look at this on the five weeks. Okay. So let's take a look at this on the monthly chart because this is the last trading week of the month for NVIDIA. What do you think? Are we hitting the top? Or do you think we still have more gas in the tank to let the market run up to around 300? Or even higher than that? What do you think? Look at this. Look at that three month price bar. That is crazy. Crazy how the market and Nvidia in the last three months alone has literally reversed the spread of this three monthly price bar, which is right here. Look at that. On this three month price bar in April, that began in April. And then next, over the last three months, it came right back up to where the high was. Crazy. This tells you that we're seeing a lot of in institutional demand, pensions, 401ks, hedge funds coming right back into NVIDIA. Why would they do that? Because they're positioning themselves for what's to come in the future. Now. Are we going to see price of NVIDIA come back down? That's the question, though. In the next five days and four hours, it's going to tell us everything we need to know. So as of right now, as of the recording of this video, market is still bullish. OK, but I am not going to put on a price prediction just yet because I need more confirmation that buyers are still here okay i need to see that so what i'm going to do simply i'm going to hold this trend line right here as a reference point for us to make the determination as to whether or not buyers are still interested in nvidia at these high prices or will the seller stage a campaign and push the price back down to where it can pick us up and move the market back up so let, let's give it a couple more days i'm gonna be viewing the market price action to see how nvidia looks and then we'll come through and drop in another price prediction whether up or down because we're unbiased as to how prices trend all right so at times the market just tells you to sit back and relax be patient let the other people deploy their own resources let them risk their money to see whether or not they're going to be right or wrong because the market will inevitably tell us the truth as to how price is going to move join me subscribe to the channel